Heidi Fang for MMA Fight Corner with Steven Seagal, Aikido, Aikido Grandmaster. So tell us, how was that translating training with Anderson and using your Aikido background to help him with his uh, training? I think it's working pretty good. And the front kicks that you've taught him and that have been used very much so in the MMA world as of late, how have you actually put that into the discipline and the everyday practice that they have? I mean, it's sort of up to them how they take whatever I teach them. And, uh, you know, they're brilliant in their own way or they wouldn't be where they are. I'm just helping them develop some of the things I've learned over the years. As far as your movie career, what do you have coming up next? Anything new? I'm making a movie in uh, New Mexico uh, this month called Forza of Execution. And is that a martial arts based film or is it just no, action? Not at all. It's just a normal action movie. What do you think about Anderson's upcoming, uh, he's had 10 fight career signed with the UFC, he's 38 years old. What do you think about the longevity of his career and maybe who he should fight next? You know, it's really hard to find an opponent for, for Anderson because he's so highly skilled at what he does. I mean, but conversely, there's plenty of great guys out there. And I think that, you know, he, he wants to fight some more, so he's going to get that chance. Would you figure Michael Bisping, John Jones, or George St. Pierre as his best next opponent? I would hope it'd be uh, George St. Pierre. Any particular reason? Because he will win that very, very quickly and very easily. <laughs> That's my humble opinion. Well, I hope to see you in uh, his training camp coming up and see you very soon. Thank you, Stephen. Take care.